Hello MechWarriors, how's it going? And welcome back to another episode of MechWarrior Online. Today guys, it is time to play the dragon. I want to play the Daka dragon, the good old 5N, because I wanted to shoot some bullets at my enemies at long, long range with a high rate of fire. And therefore, we are taking the devastating right Ultra Auto Cannon 2 arm here. We have a triplet of Ultra Auto Cannon 2s, which are dealing not that much Alpha Strike damage. However, we shoot often, we shoot fast, and over time we will rack up a sizable amount of damage in the end. We only we have six and a half tons of ammo for it, so in long games you will actually struggle a little bit. However, if you want, you can even get a little bit lower on the arm armor here, maybe on the head armor, maybe a little bit more on the leg armor to squeeze another half ton of ammo into it and you are good to go. Also, it's kind of worth noting we are running a light engine 280. If you really want it, there's also another way to do it. Uh, you, could, um, you could save a little bit of weight by going down to something like a 265, drop Pharaoh to light Pharaoh, and all of a sudden you have a little bit of room left. You can bring back the heatsink, which I believe it's actually a good idea to have, and uh, then you have room for another ton of ammo. So it kind of depends on what you want to sacrifice, um, but I would say... In most games, in 90% of the games, you have enough ammo and um, I'm planning for the 90% and not against the 10%, so that's what I'm going for. Other than that, it's really cool because we have a lot of um, armor here on our good old dragon. The dragons are known for their stability and you can see uh, we have armor center torso plus 16, right torso plus 16, right arm plus 20. The thing is sturdy for a 60 toner, it really is. And then we also have a UAC jam chance of negative 40%, which means... We can shoot a lot of time without even jamming the thing, and um, that means we basically have basically have unobstructed duck up. We can just shoot all the time. And when one of the autocannons jam, we still have enough autocannons left over that are shooting in their stead. And that's kind of the deal about this build here. Now, let's take a look at the skills here before we dive into the game. And as you can see, we have magazine capacity, we have ultra AC jam duration. I know we have a very low jam chance and the ultra 2s don't jam that long. But still, I wanted to squeeze out every point of, um, you know, uh, performance that I could get here for my ultra auto cannons. We have maximum survivability here because we are face down a stare down build we have to deal damage over time over and over and over again so our damage deliverance will take some time and therefore we are exposing ourselves a long time which means in return we will probably get shot and therefore i want to have some uh, extra armor and some extra structure around me we are going for maximum cool around maximum heat containment here because the build is quite toasty so that's the thing that is not that great i gotta say however uh, this helps out a bit so we can um, you know Constantly shoot at our enemies. Radar deprivation helps staying alive, and then we have one consumable slot that's filled with a UAV and a cool shot today. And that's the build, everybody. I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now. And if you have that, then don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing the what is that here? The Canyon Network. We are playing Skirmish, and I would say we're gonna take a nice high ground spot, as in this one here, and then we're gonna shoot around this. Uh, corner here this hill and shoot our enemies that are on the other side of the battlefield our friendlies here are still in the process of getting into the center of the map and we want to give them some support fire we want to give them some covering fire so here we go who is there there's a guy i saw somebody there's another guy and it's coming up oh he stopped moving all right there are some more people there on the left side that's a lot oh what i should be able to shoot this here all right let's go Ba -bum, ba -bum. Just peppering the Atlas so that he is not coming in uh, with full armor. And that's what we're going to be doing. Also, somebody is here. There's a Viper. Hey, cheeky Viper. Hi, hey, hi, hi, hi. Uh, let's actually aim a little bit higher. Lower, lower, lower. Oh my god, this guy is... I don't know. He's a little bit too aggressive, I think. That's what he... Oh, what? Don't shoot my arm. That arm is needed. Very much needed. Okay, they have some... Could you please go, Viper? <laughs> Leave me alone. Did we get the leg? Oh, yeah. Careful. There we go. We got the leg as well. Ba bum, ba bum, ba bum. And down he goes. Perfect. So, what's left? There is more. Wow. These guys are really, really aggressive. Also, there's a strike coming down, and I need to cool down anyway, so let's get out of here. What a fight, guys. What an early engagement. It's super good, though. I'm a big fan of that. So, my people are more or less going uh, around in the Nazca spot here. Let's go, Mr. Dragon. Dragon on dragon violence. Oh, heat level is critical again. I should go. I should really go. Uh, the enemies are kind of closing in around us. You see, Charlie 3 is kind of super hot. 
kind of super hard. You know what I mean, right? Didn't need to run into that, though. Yeah, let's get out of here. It's not good. I'm gonna pop a UAV for a nice strategic positioning, and then we're gonna get the hell out of here. So, high ground again. That's gonna be how we win. So, we are cold, which means we should shoot again. We already got half of our ammo done? Really? Oh, man. By the way, I need bigger targets. The ones that are moving around are kind of splashing all the damage so much. So, what can we shoot? Let me see. There's a lot of stuff going on. Okay. People shooting me in the butt. Oh, there's a mad cat with peeps. Ooh. Uh, is he under control, though? Uh, we have one vapor eagle on him. I'm gonna help out here, I think. I don't need to help out here. Never mind. It's all good. Uh, let's get Kilo the Mad Cat. I'm gonna help. I, uh, I don't know if it's a good idea because the thing has massive firepower and I need to deal damage over time. But currently he is harassed by a Veagle. So that's what we can do. We can help out a bit. Uh, getting shot in the back is not good, though. Good covering fire there. Yeah, they have... They have him completely covered. So now we can go in the... Ah, crap. Now we cannot go in anymore because we lost the Vapor Eagle. Are we going? Okay. I'm gonna say affirm affirmative even to that. Oh yeah, stop it, Dragon. We're gonna try to get distance between me and him. And something that is uh, helping out there. <laughs> the damage is real. Come on, guys. Swarm him. So I was disengaging, so somebody else is taking point somebody else is taking attention here and then we <laughs> just snatched the kill oopsie sorry now back to the main fight we have 200 shots left it is not looking that good honestly although we have the advantage of two but i have the feeling it kind of could turn around instantly all right see i don't want to shoot the little ones they're really hard to hit they're like really hard to hit that's a target yeah there we go Going for the summoner, PPCs and SRMs on a summoner. That guy must have no heat management, but I think he knows what he is doing there. So, God, I don't really want to go in there. I mean, he has SRMs. At the same time, he's very much killable. So, we should go. So, little one, don't shoot me in the back, okay? Because I'm about to engage your friend here. Death from above. Got him. Ooh, holy hell! Oh my god, that was a mistake, guys. Eight and five. That's, uh... That's a lot. That's my arm. It's my left arm, though. You really want me dead now. I see it. All right, cool. Bait was taken. Uh... I know there's a guy right above me. Whoopsie, I'm not here. That's oh, a friend. It's a friend, even. Thank you guys for helping out. That is amazing. So we got another kill. We have 64 shots left, and we are 10 and five. What a game! What a freaking game, guys. The dragon is, I believe, still alive there. It's a rock dragon. It's kind of the same thing that I'm doing here, but with rotary autocannons instead of... Uh, instead of the ultra autocannon twos here. So, one more target. He's pushing through, right? Yes. Yes, no escape, buddy. Pretty good. So, down to 49 shots, still alive. We have 44% of the dragon still left. However, whew, that was scary as hell. Now, let's take a look at the end score, and then we're gonna go over to the next one. We dealt solid 600 here. We got three killing blows, six assists, we got one kill most damage dealt, 483 damage done, and seven components destroyed. That was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, second game of the day. We are playing Domination on the Rubberlight Oasis. Let's get somewhere on the high ground and shoot enemies at super long range. Let's do it, guys. We have an urban mech with us, and that is good, because we have... Uh, ooh, it's even Officer K9. So yeah, Urbis are Urbis are great. Urbis are just nice battle buddies. And I I want to get to the Echo 5 high ground, maybe over to the right side, Fox 5. It depends on how my assault makes are moving. Could be that they are trying to get the low ground approach and try to get into the center of the map, but it might be that they are going more or less to the right side, which seems to happen right now. So yeah, we're gonna go with them, we're gonna meet up with them, and we're gonna have a good time with them, ideally. Uh, at the same time, uh, we are again here on the high ground, we have our range, and we should be able to shoot enemies that are popping up here in a second. I think I saw somebody in the low ground there, a second ago. Let me check it out. Yeah, that's a shadow cat. There is a shadow cat. There's some some other people as well. Is that an enemy? No, it's not. All right, so far so good. Shadow cat is repositioning. <laughs> no, that doesn't work. That doesn't work at all. There's a god. I'm I'm just too late with my reaction right now. Yeah, not so good. But we have to keep moving, guys, because my people are also moving. 
At the same time, I mean, there's a dire wolf coming up. Hmm. Wait, are you are you moving to the left? Why? What is going on here, guys? What is that UAV, by the way? Look out for a stealth mech, guys. We have UAVs in our spot. Okay, got some damage in. Oh, LB axis. Come on, let's do it again. I'm gonna just shoot back. I'm just gonna retaliate. He doesn't care. Oh my god, I should do though. Oh wait, what? Oh, another UAV is up somewhere. Yeah, I'm just gonna drop here. That's way too much for me alone. I was hoping that my friends were doing something as well, but I was the only one exposing myself on the spot. So, of course, everybody would shoot me. Not not, uh, not a complaint, by the way. Not a complaint. Just an, um, an explanation of what is going on here for all of you to understand. Why I was dropping back, why I was so much under fire, and why things were escalating like crazy. Alright. Lots of missiles here on the board. I don't like it so much, but okay. Let's get some kills, guys. Right side is seemingly clear. There's something going on there. Is that the rock guy that we saw earlier? I think it was. Yeah. <laughs> so, another kill. Let's try to get on the high ground. Alright. That's my high ground now. It belongs to me. And now we're gonna shoot to the other side of the battlefield. Somebody is calling assistance. Oh, crap. Alright, let's shoot another UAV down. What? I'm really wasting a lot of ammo for a single UAV. I have a... <laughs> I wanted to say I have my range indicator, but I wasn't having my range indicator. It was 900 meters, and I'm like, wait, that's not 900 meters. Uh, so we targeted the sky there. Anyway, we need to get into the fight again so that we can uh, kill our enemies and see them driven before you and hear the lamentation of everybody. Yeah, he's in a bad spot. And he is losing his sight also. That's what's happening. Cool. Are you hard enough to shut down? I don't know. You lost a lot of your, your ducker though. I'm gonna shot my cool shot here. Um, by the way, this Vapor Eagle is completely clueless and completely dead now. Mr. Urban Mac is coming in again. Yeah, as I was hoping. Ha, Urby for the win. Let's shoot another UAV down. It's really hard to do it while moving. We didn't even get it. Oh my god. All right, let's try again. <laughs> all righty, all righty, all righty. So we are, we are very valuable here. Ha, <laughs> UAV. All of the UAVs are belong to me, if you know what I mean. And yes, I deliberately said that wrong. Stuff going on there. Um, Alright, you know what? My people are having a fun time with the Arctic Wolf. Actually, I'm also having a fun time with the Arctic Wolf down there. But there's stuff coming from the high ground here, so let's see if we can contest that. Whatever it is. Alright, it's something fast moving. Arctic Wolf is still there. We have two more enemies next to the Arctic Wolf. It's the Shadow Cat. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna hunt the kitten. At the same time, he's probably getting pushed back. Yeah, there he is. So, uh, turning around instead of following up. We want to try to intercept him. I got another shot out, another hit there. What we need is higher ground so we get an angle. And we need aim. Alright. Good, he did not connect his PPCs. Oh man, is he doing the thing? The running away from us thing? Also, there's someone in the circle still. Somewhere. And I was assuming a stealth mech. Uh, early on, so I believe he is still the one being here, still to be the, the one that is in the circle somewhere. Uh, PPCs. Oh, there we go. So we're gonna cut his path down here. Let's go for his legs mostly? I don't know. We, don't, we did destroy an arm. Wow, that was crazy. Oh, right. So, 139 shots left. We are not ticking down the timer right now. And that's mainly because we are not in a circle. Oh, there he is. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Uh, he's coming to us. It is a flea, right? Is it a, is it a stealth flea? That's one hit in. And we got the leg. Perfect. Good job, guys. Very well done. So, yeah, we are down to 114 shots. We could still have shot a little bit longer but the game is over and officer k9 is ringing the sirens here right nice
Good game, guys. I mean, I like the I like the dragon so much because of its armor. It's so sturdy. It is so so sturdy. You can take a lot of damage while also just dealing damage to your enemies. We got a killing blow, eight kill assist. We got kill two two mess kill two most damage dealt. Yeah, that's what it's called. We have five hundred and sixty five damage done, three hundred fifty one taken. Bunch of components destroyed, and that's your daily dose for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.